Toyota is on the brink of a game-changing move with its Fortuner SUV, introducing mild hybrid technology that could redefine fuel efficiency. But there's a twist. This groundbreaking version hasn't been confirmed for Australia yet. So, what's the holdup? And could this hybrid be the future of SUVs down under? Toyota South Africa has already rolled out the Fortuner 48V, a model that's turning heads with its 48-volt battery and electric motor generator working in perfect harmony with a 2.8-liter turbo diesel engine. The result? Up to 5% better fuel efficiency. But here's where things get interesting. Despite this innovation, Australia might miss out. Why? The answer lies in the manufacturing process. While South Africa is leading the charge, Australia sources its Fortuner and Hilux models from Thailand, a factory that hasn't yet embraced this hybrid tech. So, will Aussies ever get their hands on this fuel-saving marvel? Here's where things get even more intriguing. Australia has already welcomed mild hybrid tech with open arms in the Hilux V-Active and is eagerly awaiting it in the upcoming 250 series Land Cruiser Prado. Yet, the Fortuner, a staple on Australian roads since 2015, remains in limbo. Why hasn't Toyota Australia made a move? Could it be the unique design differences between the Fortuner sold in Australia and South Africa? Or is there more to the story? The South African Fortuner 48V, with its 150 kilowatts of power and 500 newton meters of torque, shares a lot with Australia's Hilux V-Active, right down to the turbo diesel engine. But here's the kicker, it lacks the 8-speed automatic transmission that's set to debut in the new Land Cruiser Prado, a feature that could take fuel efficiency to the next level. And then there's the price. The mild hybrid Fortuner comes with a price bump, around $900 more than its traditional counterpart. But with the Fortuner struggling to keep up with rivals like the Ford Everest in Australia, could this hybrid be the spark it needs to reclaim its place in the market?